Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. It's a good day in the Riley household. Natalie's home from the hospital. Yes, strong. She's just a fat, oh my God, look at my muscle. I've been doing weight training lately and you can kind of see it there, look. Anyway, distracted. I'm doing, no, this way is better, stay this way. <laughs> I'm doing my mug tour that was supposed to be uploaded on Wednesday, then it was supposed to be uploaded on Thursday, now it's uploaded on Sunday, aka today. So, there they are, there's my babies, I laid them all out second time, so fingers crossed, hopefully you're watching this right now, because if you are, that means I didn't delete the footage again. Woohoo, let's get stuck in before I do that again. So if you want to see my mugs, just keep watching. Where do I begin? I guess. Hi. Where do I begin? I suppose I'll go through like one by one and then see where I bring you, explain where I got it, if I remember how much it was, all the fun stuff. Let's get started, I suppose. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, I broke it up into rows. That's like, the, those three there are the biggest ones. This one, two, three, four, five is like the bigger again, or no, smaller again. And these are like medium sized. Smaller again, and then smallest. Let's get started. First smoke I'm gonna start off with is my big Thorpe Park one. I love it because it has like the Swarm, Saw, Nemesis Inferno, Stealth, and Colossus, which are all the rides in Thorpe Park. It's big, obviously it's as big as my head, and nothing is as, not many things are as big as my head. It has a little roller coaster thing around it, and it's big, it holds a liter. So yeah, got this in Thor Park when I was there. I think it was like 20 quid. So yeah, this is my second big cup. It says London on it. London. And then it has ugh, the dungeons on it because I got it in London Dungeons. There's nothing inside though. This also holds a litre. My third and last mug that holds a litre. I got this in Chessington World of Adventures. It says on both sides and yeah, this also holds a litre. Next up is my medium sized mugs. First one is this kind of it's nice though, it's big. It's like tartan or plaid pattern, whatever you want to call that. And it has a little gold metallic heart on the front. And it's cute. It's pennies. It's from pennies. Um, it came with a chocolate set in it. But it says not suitable for microwave use, hand wash only. Which is the only annoying thing about it because you can't put it in the microwave or the dishwasher. But other than that, oh, it holds 500 milliliters. Next up is my Mr. Greedy mug. On this side, his belly's rumbling and it says Mr. Greedy. On this side it says Mr. Greedy and he's eating cake. Then on the inside, in this day, or on this side it says, today is a greedy day. This holds 500 milliliters. It's a pity they don't have the Mrs. Greedy one, but they don't. But yeah, I had to get it because it's fab. Natalie got me this for Christmas one year. I just realized that I wasn't actually saying where I got them. But yeah, these three big London ones I obviously got in London in theme parks and stuff. Natalie got me the Mr. Greedy one. And this one I got for Christmas off my brother and um, sister-in-law. It's funny because my oldest niece actually has this and got it for Christmas too. So now we have matching mugs, hey yeah. Next up is my Central Perk mug. It says Central Perk on both sides. It's fab. You would have seen this mug if you watched my Penny's Haul video. So if you haven't watched that, go check it out. I'll link it down in the description below. Plug, plug. But yeah, this also holds around 500 milliliters. Oh, and I got it in pennies, obviously, because it was my pennies haul. Can't remember how much it was, so go watch the video. This one is also from pennies. It has loads of cool things on it. It says like, indulge, yummy, treat yourself, coffee heaven. It says like loads of yummy things just going around. It's really cute. And this also, it's chubby, it's fat, it's lovely. And this also holds 500 litres. I bought this in pennies. It was probably, I think it was like a fiver. Let's go with that. This one is my Yum Yum mug. It's the exact same pattern and style mug as the black one I showed you last. Claire actually got me this while we're in college together and it came, I'm pretty sure it came with a little chocolate set or something, little mini whisks. God, that was for like my 19th birthday. That's going back a few years. That's crazy. Memories. Moving on to my medium sized mugs. First up is my little honey pot mug. I got this in pennies also. I can't remember how much it was, but like it's proper Disney. And my favorite thing about it is that the honey is spelled like the way it's spelled on the honey pots in Winnie the Pooh. Cause one of the ends is backwards and it's really cute. Love. 
Next up is my second Winnie the Pooh mug, which is Eeyore. You would have seen him if you watched my current favourite. So if you haven't watched my current favourites, I'll link that down in the description below. Love him. His tail is the handle. His mould, like his head comes out of the mould. It is the cutest freaking thing ever. And he's dishwasher safe and microwave safe. So he's a little hard ass. Love it. How much was he? How much were you, Eeyore? I think you were like eight years old. Eight year old. Third and last Winnie the Pooh mug, it's, it says I'd rather be in bed and it's Winnie the Pooh lying down on his side. Really cute, it's small just when you want a little small cup of tea and not a big one. Can't really relate to that though because I usually always want big ones but when I do want a small one, I have Winnie the Pooh. Got him in pennies, how much was he or did someone else get me him? I think Natalie got me this for my birthday. Mm -hmm. Next on to my Harry Potter collection. This was a latte mug because it's like narrow and <coughs> tall. <laughs> My mugs are making noises. It says nine and three quarters Hogwarts Express and on the back it has four of the little small crests like inside one big crest. It's really cute and it's maroon. I love the colour. I got this in GameStop in Navin for... I think I got two for ten because I have another one. I'll show you now. Exact same design and everything. This is my second Harry Potter mug. It is the one that I got, well I bought them separately, but it was either like 15 euro for one mug or like two for a tenner, so I've got two. So yeah, it says Hogwarts and it says don't let the muggles get you down. So whenever I'm having a bad day, I have this and I'm like, don't let the muggles get you down, Leanne, just don't. I love it because it's white and then the words are maroon. And on the back has the same cross, but just all the maroon, not colour. Love. Third in my Harry Potter collection, <coughs> excuse me, is this one that says, I solemnly swear that I am up to no good and has crests in the background. It says it on both sides and it's small just like the Winnie the Pooh one. Natalie got me this for when I passed my driving test. Yeah, my driving test. Next up, sorry, I think I have something in my eyeball. Next up is my colour changing Harry Potter mug. My fourth, yeah, fourth and last Harry Potter mug. It's black, it has like little footprints on the back of it. And then on the front it says, I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. And then when you put hot water in it, it changes white, like the Marauder's map print comes up on both sides. And yeah, you would have seen this mug if you seen my, um, I think it was Dear Donald Trump video. So yeah, go check out that video too. Plug, 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 plugging everywhere, plugging everywhere. Forgot to say that that colour changing um, Harry Potter mug, Natalie also got me that. Pretty sure she actually got most of my more collection to be honest so shout out to you Natalie thank you big thanks next up is my mustache mustache mug which Natalie also got for me this side you have you can have normal mustache or this side you can have like handlebar mustache sorry you probably couldn't hear me because the cup the cup was over my mouth this side is normal mustache and this side is a handlebar mustache so it's really cute that was like my second mug ever actually because my first mug the handle kind of broke on it. It was a big fat red cup that said mug of tea. Natalie also got me that too. And this, she's the best sister ever. Next up is Drama Llama. Look at him just chilling, hey yeah. This was from Penny's, this was from Chris, Chris Kringle, Secret Santa, whatever you want to call it. Chris Kingle, Chris Kringle, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, okay? I just don't know. And to be honest, I don't care. Just don't. So anyway, yeah, this was from Pennies. This is from my friend Ross for Chris. Kingle, whatever you want to call it, this year. So it's fab. And it comes with hot chocolate in it and marshmallows and it's really cute. And my younger niece has this for Christmas actually because it's funny because I actually got this for her for Christmas and then I was like, we have matching mugs. So now my two nieces, we, both have, we all have matching mugs. It's amazing. Next up is my I Heart Amsterdam mug. I got this in Primark. Well, pennies, we call it pennies, but it was Primark over there. Why did, actually, why does Ireland, why is Ireland the only place that calls it pennies? Actually, I don't know that. Anyone who knows the answer to that comment down below I might actually have to ask Siri, so I'm not sure. But anyway, that just popped into my head, so I'm actually wondering that now. I heard Amsterdam, spoiler alert, I got it in Amsterdam. It's dishwasher safe, it's microwave safe, it's amazing, it's chubby, it's just in the middle of small and big, so I love it. Yeah, that was five euro actually. Next up is this I woke up like this mug. This was from Penny's. Natalie got me this for, for Christmas one year. It's fab. 
Next up is onto my Starbucks collection. This is a flat, kind of like cappuccino style mug, I suppose you could say. It's amazing. It's like proper Starbucks. I got that in a Christmas set from Natalie. Sorry, I'm just trying to put it down quiet. Because she's upstairs napping. Um, I'll stay on the Starbucks one. This is from Starbucks too. It just doesn't say Starbucks on it anywhere, but I got it in a Christmas set with a tin of biscuits. I got that for... Um, Got that for Chris Kringle off a co-worker one year. This is another Starbucks mug. It's really cute. It's really small. It has like berries and plants on it. It's so cute. I actually have a cup of soups in this because it's the perfect chubbiness to like dip. Uh, dip toast in? Not toast. Dip your bread in when you're having cups of soup. I got that. Where did I get that one actually? I think I got that for Christmas off Natalie too one year. She literally bought me all my mugs, not even joking. Thank you. Next up is this Little Miss Giggles mug. mug. Yeah, I got this off my ex. I need to redo that because that was so awkward. I literally never use it, but I just like bin it. No. Next up is this Little Miss Giggle mug. Um, I got this off my ex-boyfriend a few years ago, but it's cute. I can't get rid of it because it's me in a cup. Look at her. There's me. Hey, yeah. Oh my god. That'd be my merch, Little Miss Giggles. <laughs> on a sweater. Hey, yeah. Sweater? What am I American? I mean, jumper. <laughs> Next is this little flash mug. It says Star Laboratories. Laboratories? Laboratories? I don't know. Natalie got me this as a present. Surprised. Natalie also got me this lovely mug. It's Britney Survived 2007. You can handle today mug. It's one of my favorites actually. I have this a lot of times. It's amazing. It's amazing. And last but not least, my pink mug. It's teeny tiny. I hardly ever use it because it's so freaking small. Like what? Compared to my liter one that was like the size of my head. But anyway, I bought, bought it at a pink concert when I went to see her a few years ago and it's amazing. I can't get rid of it because I love pink and I support everything she does. So she's amazing. Little legend. So that is all my mugs. I think I have. One, two, three. 26. 26 mugs for little old me. So yeah, that's my mugs. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Feel free to send me more mugs or comment down below any pictures slash links of other mugs that I should buy because even though I have 26, you can never have enough. Just saying, comment down below your favourite mug because literally it's so hard to pick a favourite sometimes or like my babies I can't choose. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed. See you in the next video. Peace.